Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. In this video, we actually have some very, very intriguing target news going on. Now, I'm sure a lot of you guys are out there who've kind of been patiently waiting for the next upcoming PlayStation 5 restock, and we've actually been hearing a lot of more community news going on when it comes to the PlayStation, a little bit of walk-in news, a little bit of stock arrivals, and the very, very small chance of stock is potentially dropping tomorrow. I do want to go have a pretty quick, like, pre-mention, though, that I have not really seen a major, major increase of stock arrivals or stock movements going on when it comes to all these stores, so while we are hearing a lot of rumors for it being tomorrow which is why i'm going to talk about this talk about the rumors and talk about why it might actually be potentially dropping tomorrow i don't want to let you guys know i haven't seen any major movement and major stock stuff too as well so i'm kind of myself going to maybe keep on sleeping on in mainly because as well i also have a lot of blizzards over here in chicago so it's kind of a little bit cold and i wouldn't mind just staying on my bed and going and relaxing and chilling but we have a few things to go talk about a few little walking updates too as well and we've also even seen some very intriguing stuff up from tiktok that also had like a lot of stock available in target shelves so there's kind of a lot of little weird kind of strange that going on when it comes to target itself so we're going to talk about that throughout this video so make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new playstation 5 giveaway amazon links down below for the ps5 disc digital console controller twitter and twitch stream as well link down below sign up for weeble and deposit one dollars get a bunch of free stock for my some of those samsung ssds and phones down below and i appreciate you guys so much for watching let's go dive into the video itself so first and foremost we actually are hearing some a little bit on the intriguing side when it comes to the Target and Target restock. So when it comes to that, we have actually been seeing a little bit of rumors, and we've had two... Let me go touch on these two really quick things. Number one, we actually have had some employees go and confirm that they are still sitting on some stock. Now, we were also seeing stock sitting around as of the last prior drop, but it's kind of intriguing because, well, we've had a very, very quiet past about week, week and a half when it comes to almost all restocks out there. So I want to let you guys know, we've had a few Target employees go and state that their store physically still has some stock. Some stores said that they had like seven consoles in the back, another store had three consoles. Now, does that necessarily qualify for a proper normal restock tomorrow? I don't want to say yes or no. I mean, a lot of these things are always kind of on the guest side. But it doesn't really seem that we've seen so many big distributions out there. But we have also seen reports, if I'm going to talk about the reports in a second, which does bump it up at least a little tiny bit. So when it comes to all the stock and stock movement for it, some stores are sitting on stock. And that was the same way as before as the previous drops to as well. So that kind of means that there is a small chance for tomorrow. Although I myself, I'm being honest with you guys, I'm hearing rumors, I'm hearing community members, I'm hearing other stuff. But a lot of my own contacts and other restock tracker friends of mine are also not really saying too much on it too as well. So like all everyone who I've talked to, I literally just texted a few folks and got the information off them. Doesn't really necessarily seem like there will be a drop tomorrow. But I always like to throw on the maybes just in case there's a small chance that there is something going on. If there would be to be around the 6.30 a.m. to around the 6.30 a.m. Central Time to around the 7 a.m. Central Time, if we had to go guess and see. But when it comes to those overall numbers, I'm probably going to be staying up. I'm going to be sleeping. I'm going to be chilling on that one. But with the fact that we are seeing some stores, sitting up some stock in the back house is very, very intriguing to go and know, which, like I said, it kind of bumps up the likelihood of an upcoming drop, at least in the near future. But we are also hearing reports, too, as well. We even had a Reddit user go and state, stating, hey, we've gotten word they're shipping them out from distribution centers. So you're shipping out PlayStation 5 stock from the Target distribution centers. Usually that means that there's a drop imminent. As far as far as our line, it's basically just more on, on the actual in online drop itself. So it's very interesting to go and see this because we are seeing some folks stating that there is stock moving from distribution centers and warehouse movements or whatever, blah, blah, blah. And that would also maybe mean that some stores would be getting stock. But the one next thing, as I mentioned, is that all my contacts I've talked to over at Target have not gotten any additional stock. And that's why I'm kind of maybe anticipating more. We'll see more maybe information over the weekend or on Monday. But I did want to go and make sure to bring this up to you guys in case we guys did go and see this. We have been hearing rumors. We've had a few different folks as well bring this up to me. It's not just a one singular person. And as well, with stock sitting in the stores, there's always that small chance there could be some stock moving out for a proper online drop. This would be an online order in-store pickup for the usual in-store drops. So be on the lookout for that and watch on that. I myself, though, as I mentioned, the likelihood seems very, very small. I just want to port on it because we've been hearing lots of rumors and other things floating around when it comes to the next upcoming target drop. So keep that in mind. We'll kind of give you guys more updates. I'm probably going to be staying up. I'm going to be more so sleeping myself because it doesn't really seem that likely. We haven't seen the big stock movements. My own target sources are not confirming that. But I just want to let you guys know we have at least been seeing it going around. So at least you guys know. Now, the part two of this is actually something that we've also been seeing a lot more of, but it's a lot more on the like expected side, I would say, for lack of better terms. Target walk-ins. 
Now, we've actually now seen, I think, three different states that have actually now been allowing even more target walk-ins. There is also even a TikTok itself that people are going and sharing around that actually had a lot of stock. There's around like 15 PlayStation 5 normal boxes in stock at Target stores. So we've actually heard some up in Hawaii, which we have actually covered maybe around a month ago or so, where we did so see Target employees basically have like a nice like press, uh, I don't, know, like, I don't know, like a writing, I guess, you know, how, like how sometimes like you're in like a grocery store or whatever, blah, blah, blah. So basically like, you know, you have that little paper and they're like, hey, walk-ins available. Here's the stock numbers. Here's the dates. And they were seeing some of those up in the Hawaii. So if you guys are actually watching my videos up in the like Honolulu and stuff, number one, I'm jealous. There's snow over up in Chicago, but we have been seeing that. And it did also seem confirmed from Target employees that they might be able to go start doing more walk-ins. But the part two of this is we actually had a few more reports up in New York and as well, I think in Wisconsin, that some of those Target stores actually had stock available to go and put it up on the shelves themselves. So it's very intriguing to kind of go and see all these numbers. It's very, very intriguing to go and see that we're seeing some more walk-ins. And it's not just like in a one individual store, but we're seeing it in a few other different like states and different locations too as well. I have reached out before, this was maybe like a month, month and a half ago or so for my Target videos, where I did actually go here and notice that my Target employees can go and sell stock that's available on shelves. It is possible, although most of the time we see it right afterwards if it's for a canceled order or an order never gets picked up or there's extra stuff that was just like basically delivered late. Most of the time, Target's still preferring online order in-store pickup, not like just pure walk-ins. But as I mentioned, we have been seeing a few reports up on Reddit and a few reports up on Twitter and as well a few employees that are stating that walk-ins are actually happening and floating around. So I know that's not like a global national restock stuff for all of you guys because not every Target store, not every Target state is having stock, but it's very intriguing to go and see that we're now seeing a higher uptake of PlayStation 5s, especially for walk-ins and on the shelves. If I can go and find the TikTok itself, maybe I'll try to show you guys in tomorrow morning's video or throughout the next few days, but we have been seeing that floating around. And there's been a lot of pictures about it, talking about it, and they have actually confirmed from that that those stocks were available to be purchased and they were purchased by individual folks with a one-person limit. So it's very just intriguing information. Target definitely seems up in the air, and I think all of us are just slowly trying to find the next restock. We did have good news with the Best Buy, which we covered earlier on today and yesterday, where it does kind of seem like they're allowing more in app purchases and in-app buys i'm like kind of intrigued on all that stuff i think it's kind of nifty kind of cool but on the point too as well as also we're still waiting for amazon because we're still waiting to see any bit and piece of amazon stock arrivals or any type of movement which is why we're at the stock and like you know the links down below and the same thing too with this target stuff the fact that we're now seeing people in the community stating that there's been stores getting stock and distributions from warehouses moving out is very intriguing to see. So like I said, my contacts have a good content in New York and also in Las Vegas. They both have not received additional stock, but they are sitting on a little baby bit of stock. I don't think it'll be dropping tomorrow, at least if I had a guess, but there is always that small smidgen, more so based on the overall everyone else bringing up the information on it. My information though, like I said though, is not 100% saying there's gonna be a drop. I'd probably still wanna give a little bit more time for them to build up stock, get some shipments maybe throughout the weekend and also go from there. But like I said, I always feel like obligated to let you guys know in just case someone really wants to wake up in the early mornings to be on the lookout for a target drop. Like I said, though, I myself am not going to be up for it. I'm just seeing this from random, unverified sources. But I feel like sometimes there are rumors because I've had so many people tweet at me in YouTube comments asking about more upcoming restacks. I can at least give you guys some bit of more of uh, updated information on when the next restack might be going on. I myself am still a bit more closely watching on the Amazon and Best Buy side. So maybe tomorrow will come in clutch and I'll probably talk about that in the tomorrow morning's video. But like I said, if we got information or we're seeing reports of it, we're seeing reports of walk-ins, we're seeing reports of stock arrivals, we're seeing reports of warehouse stuff. At least I think it's somewhat worth mentioning, and we'll give you guys more details as we go get it uh, just throughout these next few days. So if anything, we'll probably get more information on the weekend or on Monday, Tuesday, if there is any stock movement, and we'll go from there. But there's always that very, very smidgen chance that tomorrow morning there'll be a restock. I kind of think it's kind of just like maybe a shot in the dark based on me doing this for how, however long I've been doing it. So uh, like I said, it's not a verifiable source, but we have been seeing folks mentioning it and bringing it up soon as well. So I figured I'd at least bring it up on a video itself. So let's let you guys know on that one more so the walking stuff, which was actually from pictures and other verifi verifiable stuff. It's a little bit more on the intriguing side for me, if anything. So I just want to give you guys that quick little midday update. Nothing super crazy for little target restock updates in general. So make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway. 
Amazon links down below for the PS5 disc digital console controller. Samsung SSDs down below. We also have the Samsung phones down below too as well. Twitter and Twitch stream if you guys want to follow. Check out those Amazon links. Just waiting for those and the Weebles and the coin bases. And we'll see you guys probably up a little bit later on tonight for maybe one more little comfy video and for sure more restack stuff as soon as we get to go and see it happen. So I appreciate all you guys so much for watching. Leave your likes and thoughts and comments down below. And like I said, very, very small smidgen of chance, but at least it's kind of worth covering up in the first place. So love you guys all so much. I appreciate you guys all so much for watching.